My name is David Delergio. I'm a cardiac electrophysiologist at Emory University Hospital Midtown. One of my specialty areas is the treatment of patients with atrial fibrillation. Atrial fibrillation is very common and often produces debilitating symptoms such as shortness of breath and palpitations. Some patients will be at increased risk of stroke due to atrial fibrillation as well. Therefore, if you suspect you have an arrhythmia such as atrial fibrillation, you should get immediate medical attention. Some patients will feel so poorly during an episode of atrial fibrillation that they should be seen in the emergency room. In the emergency room, tests will be made, such as an EKG, an echo, perhaps blood work, and other tests as indicated to properly diagnose the arrhythmia. Other patients may sense palpitations or shortness of breath, but not really feel too sick. In that case, we recommend contacting your physician. Your physician may produce similar, similar tests, such as an EKG and blood work, and they may refer you on to see a cardiac specialist, such as myself. My job is to carefully diagnose, quickly and accurately, the problem of atrial fibrillation. I may recommend monitoring systems, such as a Holter monitor or an outpatient monitor, to clearly diagnose the arrhythmia. And I may even recommend more invasive tests, such as electrical testing of the heart and sometimes implantable recorders to more clearly diagnose rare and fleeting arrhythmias. If you have atrial fibrillation, treatment will be instituted. In some patients, it may be medications, that will reduce the chances of recurrence. In other patients, it may be anticoagulants as well. It's very important that we diagnose atrial fibrillation correctly and rule out associated risk factors so that appropriate treatment can be offered. At Emory, we realize that atrial fibrillation is a very common and potentially very dangerous arrhythmia. I appreciate your listening to this video today, and I hope that I can help you in the future. Thank you.